Let's get productive. Hello and welcome to the first day back at term. I can't believe we're back already, but hi, if you're new here, I'm Louise. I'm at the University of St Andrews. I mean like, can it get any more obvious with this jumper? I don't know, but I'm doing a master's in psychology, specifically focusing on eating disorders, and I love it. That's what's on my computer right now, but hello, long time no see from Scotland. I know I did like a little few days at home vlog, but I've been a little bit bad and taking quite a big hiatus from YouTube. Mwah, I still love you all, I'm so sorry. But I was really aggressively burnt out at the end of last year and I feel a whole lot better. But it's about like 11 o'clock on Monday morning, Monday the 17th of January. And I'm officially back in, back in uni work, back in uni season. I don't know how to say that. This could potentially be my last semester at university, like ever. I'm undecided of whether to do a PhD, get a job. Um, Adulting is not it, but we're not having a crisis this video, I hope. We're just gonna get shit done and have a very productive first week back. I do have a lot on this week, but I feel like approach that as the week comes on. Today, I very desperately have to send a few emails, edit my ethics application for the fucking third time, and then, well, third of all, I have to read a paper for a call. I have later discussing it, so. Fun, 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 and basically all I have done this morning is try and order more coffee because how great is it on the first day back I ran out of ground coffee. Happy Monday! And then it wouldn't let me order it, so that's fun. I'm gonna try again because I really deeply love ground coffee and my French press and just the instant stuff just doesn't hit right. It really doesn't, but I could ramble about coffee forever and ever and ever, but Let's get productive. After lunch, I am rejuvenated with cups of tea and I'm back, unfortunately. I mean, to this vlog I never really went anywhere, but I have ethics is done. Woo! What I also did, I don't know if you can see, these like really cute little hearts above my head. What I decided to do was like my most pressing tasks I'd like put on post-it notes and these little heart ones are just adorable. So whenever they're done, I can very dramatically rip them off the wall. One of my least favorite parts of the whole week is Monday afternoons because my supervisor also supervises a lot of other like PhD students and like research students. And she hosts like this, I very affectionately call it journal club. This is like a very intense and academic like journal article discussion group, like proper like published papers that we like read, annotate, make talking points and then all discuss together, which is, it's a fantastic learning opportunity and I get to like expand my worldview with other really cool PhD students, but it's terrifying and I'm the only master's student. So of course, it's my least favorite time of the week. Have I read the paper yet? No. Is it less than an hour until my meeting? Yes well done and today it is my supervisor herself who has chosen the paper but oh, yes it's only like six pages long fantastic because some of them are really long and i've definitely left this way too last minute but i read and annotate it on my ipad i've been using this and featured it in vlogs before so i'm not touching on that too deeply but my mum got one of these for Christmas and she decided that she was going to buy me one for my birthday, which is, it's still upcoming, it's the 1st of February, but um, she let me use it early. And this is, this is a pillow pad. It's so cool, right? So like, my iPad is gonna sit on this and it's like it has its own pillow. So yes, 
I am gonna do my reading with my little pillow buddy. Short paper and my little pillow. It's definitely gonna make it a lot more bearable. I am progressively looking more and more disheveled as this day goes on. And it matches how I feel. But we're done! It's five o'clock, thank God. The, like By the time five o'clock on a Monday rolls round, it's just a sigh of relief. Then you realise you still have the whole week to go. It's not great. But my call really wasn't bad. I said I was really over traumatic earlier. As I always am, really, like... I have a YouTube channel. I have a flair for the dramatics. I am dramatic as hell. But I've done quite a lot today and I'm actually quite proud. It feels like I'm doing nothing at the time, but whenever it gets to the end of the day, it's like, I did that. Happy Tuesday. I am deeply overwhelmed, pretty anxious, a little bit down. So desk, be gone. I'm going on a walk and leaving the house, hopefully. Hopefully it cheers me up a little bit. Hello, happy Tuesday, hope you're doing well. You're getting lovely webcam quality because my camera is in the other room. I just filmed a video, you might recognize the shirt. It's super cute. I'm shitting myself right now. I also feel I just said Tuesday as Wednesday. It kind of demonstrates where my brain's at. I have two interviews. Like one is in like 10 minutes and the other one's in like a few hours. Something very exciting that I can't talk about yet. But I'm like crapping my pants at the thought. So hope your day's going better than mine. I am severely anxious right now. But I will update it uh, when they're done, I guess. Oh, I fucking hate opening my camera. I was so excited to tell you guys my interviews are done. And I have a fucking spot that's come up. That's like 100% a stress induced spot. I'm not happy. I hate fucking spots. I'm just gonna like talk like this from here on out. I'm not actually, I'm sorry. I'm rambling, but my interviews are done. I had two and they went well. Fingers crossed, but they went well. I feel, I feel really bad that I'm like not talking to you guys more about this, but it's a really cool opportunity. It's a, like, it's a uni kind of thing. It's not like a YouTube thing, I'm sorry. Um, But yeah, whether it works out or whether it doesn't work out, I'm just not ready to talk about it yet. So I'll keep you guys updated. I don't know when they're gonna get back to me. I have one more tomorrow and then we're done. So it might be soon, it might not be soon, but yeah. I am not gonna go get changed out of this shirt, which I love so much. I got it in the next seal. But I'm all wobbly, but like, look at that collar. She is stunning. I'm a fashionista. I kind of feel like a doll, like with a little short bob and the shirt but I am like so ridiculously into it but now I'm going to get dressed into like a way oversized comfy jumper watch some more dope sick which is my current obsession it's on Disney plus and I my boyfriend's been talking about it and I kind of thought it was going to be a bit crap but it's so good it's a hard-hitting drama on the opioid crisis in America which I thought sounded really dull that's awful but I did think it sounded not up my street but it's fantastic like I 10 out of 10 recommend I'm gonna go and find books on the opioid crisis after this. But yeah, two episodes left and then I'm done. So I'm gonna go binge that. Catch you later.
let's go. It is much later in the day, but all of my interviews are done. My fingers are crossed. I think they went well, but I'm over it now. I'm just not thinking about it. That's a lie. I'm thinking about it literally at every second ever because I mean, they finished like an hour, two hours ago and I'm ready like, hi, when are you getting back to me? When are you telling me whether I've got this or not? Oh, the joys of academia. But I have been, I have to shut down my laptop so you can't see anything on it. But I've been doing like a systematic review, reading a lot of papers, making notes on a lot of papers and I love research because I need to write my own literature review as a part of a report that I have soon. So I'm already kind of behind. I'm kind of used to like waiting until near the deadline to get things done. Whereas now I have a supervisor who wants to like read over, help, make adjustments and make it the best it can be, which I'm so not used to. So I was like, oh, it's not you till the end of February. And the other day she was like, oh, how's it going? Cause you know, like anytime you want, I can read through it and make adjustments. And I was like, crap, I have to work overtime to get like a first draft to you so we can reformulate that more. My English is just like not working. It's like nearly 7 p.m. I'm starving and I'm coming down from the Adrenaline High videos. So I have videos, interviews. I'm not making any sense. I'm gonna go get dinner and stop taking this clip because I do not know what I'm gonna say next. Hello, good morning. It's now Friday and I'm actually coming on to end the vlog here. Today I have realistically a lot of work and things I should be doing, but I'm really just going out to get coffee with my friend. So I guess this is the end of my first week back. It's St Andrews and my kind of week in the life uni vlog. I don't quite know what you call these. That's for editing Louise to find out. But thank you so much for being here. I feel this is ridiculously long and full of rambles, but we'll see. I hope you enjoyed anyway. Mwah. See you next week.